when you have that feeling of the cold or the flu, that stuffy, makey, miserable ugh, you know, kind of feeling <laughs> yeah. coming on? I do. Yeah, because I know that you feeling said right it now. Well, one of the first things we think about is grabbing a hot bowl of chicken soup, oh, yeah. right? Millions of moms recommend it, but does it really help? It, it, it's got to be better than chicken shawarma. That's all I can say. <laughs> For the cold, maybe, right? <laughs> Dr. Parthen Andy joins us right now to find out uh, if chicken soup really is the cure. Yeah, it's one of those things that we always think it helps, but really, I think it really does. So here's, here's the thing. Chicken soup won't necessarily cure a cold or flu. Its benefits uh, make it a good choice when you're feeling less than your best. Okay, I think so it's how? So it can't make the virus go away and cure it like you said, but what, what does it do in us that makes well, us feel the better? The stuff in the soup, right? Yeah. So soup can help alleviate congestion. And then hot broth causes dilation of the blood vessels, which increases hmm. the blood flow and allows the mucus to flush everything out. So another thing, soup can help you keep hydrated. Now, clear broths contain both water and salt, and that you need for hydration. And soups can also reduce inflammation. Soups that include vegetables provide anti-inflammatory properties, beta carotene, vitamin C. And lastly, soup can help soothe that sore throat. Hmm. The salt from the, and the broth can kill the germs and dry out mucus. So all that stuff your mom said, you know, and my kids love chicken soup when you get sick so it's actually maybe true now can't we just figure a way to put chicken soup in a pill yeah, right. <laughs> uh, you know I think they're trying to I'm sure yeah, people are trying to right. yeah. but you know these pills that have like you know cure every symptom I don't yes. really like that I think we should target the symptoms so for example if you just have a sore throat and a headache it's one thing instead of getting the all symptoms pill I think you should just make it tailor-made what do you like that like acetaminophen for something and... exactly so you picked one of them you know for pain reliever acetaminophen also called Tylenol or maybe Advil if for a runny nose a decongestion like pseudoephedrine and for cough a, suppre a suppressant of a cough that you can ask, you know, over the counter. So I think that just make sure you, you chicken soup is great, keep yourself hydrated and rested. Yeah, because sometimes when you put all those in, you don't need all those things. And in you the all the health. side effects that go along That's with right. it. very true. So, oh, what do you have at five? You know, we're talking about, you know, guess what? When you shovel snow, some of the dangers, number one, your heart, number two, your back. We'll be out there shoveling snow so we can, we can show you what's going on. You have to watch. All right, good. Good tips you've got coming up on Action News Absolutely. at five. Thanks for watching, everyone. Action News at five starts right now.